Hey there, you came here to enter the... I'm in charge of... Let me know if there's... Uh, uh... Oh, it's... Uh, <clears throat> Sorry. First, we have... If you want to participate in the tournament, go ahead and visit the VR Ninjutsu Arena. I'll explain everything when... Mission accomplished. Oh. This is Lord Kakashi Hatake the sixth Hokage, and the teacher of our current Hokage. He'll be the one in charge of the VR Ninjutsu Arena during the tournament period. I'm just helping out a bit, really. So, is this the new tournament participant that I read about in the report? Yep, sure is. And I've been put in charge of the guide duties. I see. Well, let me quickly explain how the arena works, then. It's pretty simple, really. You see, our village has developed a VR device. It lets you train anywhere that you... It's simple. One of the coolest things about... Not the real... Oh, by the way, the Ninja World League Arena is based on some stages from... They're from the times where the 6th and 7th were still active in the field. And here, young ninja can fight... <laughs> Doesn't that just get your blood pumping? Well, whether it's pumping or not... Ready for this? Okay, let's start with the basics. First comes movement. Try moving over towards me. Next is wall running. Try running up that cliff. If you run straight toward it, you'll be able to run up the side of it. Good. Looks like you know how to control your chakra properly. Now I'll tell you about chakra jumps. You can use those to jump even farther distances. Thank <laughs> you. 
run across a wide valley, just use a wire kunai. You can use a recovery if it seems like you're gonna fall off the cliff, so don't forget. teach you how to attack. All right, try attacking your opponent now. The key to attacking is to always keep an eye on your opponent. And on the battlefield, losing sight of your opponent is akin to suicide. Always keep this in mind. Throwing kunai is a good way to hit far away enemies. That's the spot! Now, you'll need to protect your body when your enemy attacks. Do this by guarding. Guard in order to withstand your opponent's attacks and create openings. Now, you should know that you also have the ability to deflect enemy attacks while guarding. Don't forget to predict your opponent's moves and dodge when you can. If there's not enough time to guard or dodge, remember that you can always just use a substitution jutsu. After using the jutsu, you can take a moment to think and plan your counterattack. Continue our training. Ninjutsu. As you probably know, ninjutsu can be activated by channeling chakra. The effects of each jutsu widely vary. Some jutsu are made for dealing damage, while others can be used to impair opponents' abilities or to freeze them in place. Finding the ninjutsu that best fits your own fighting style is the key to attaining victory. Aside from basic ninjutsu, we also have secret techniques. In order to activate a secret technique, one needs a large amount of chakra. But be aware that these techniques are much stronger than normal ninjutsu. Use your chakra, wait for the right timing, then aim and fire. 
Well, that's it for basic training. Now, just don't forget to practice. Good work, and keep on doing your best. Right, some new mission, some... Okay, I just added a mission. Hmm, how about this? Good idea. You can start the mission whenever you want. Once you're ready, speak to the sixth. Ready for this? I erase all who oppose me. Don't fall behind! Is only for myself. Here. 